Hi, welcome to a video about Linux kernels again. We've just made an article and a video about um, the different kernels you can install. So, Serum Pacman minus S. Oh, a minus would be nice. S and then Linux. And just press twice on tap. You can install Linux. You can install Linux Hardened is a kernel. Linux LTS is one and Linux Zen. So four kernels to test out, but let's assume that when you updated your system just with the command update, that you have um, received a kernel that's not working for you. You, either, you want to have a kernel back that you used to have. You can always, and it's already installed for you guys, as downgrade. There's an application called to downgrade a particular package. So you need to know the name, Firefox, um, Chrome stable, Chromium stable, um, and in this case, Linux. So if you type this one, you can see there is a lot of um, choices you can, can take. So from 18.7, the 6, the 5, the 4, 3, 2, 1, all the way back to the 4.16 are ready for you to have. So there is the remote version, so get it from the internet, get it from here, meaning local. Maybe an interesting idea to show you as well. I always learn you more than the title of the video. It's in var, cache, pacman, packages. Linux. It is indeed here. I have been working. The Linux hardened is here. Linux LTS is here. Linux Zen is here. That is because of the tutorial I just made. All these Linux kernels are on the system. That's why it says local. It's there already. So, what if um, we want to get something older? Let's go way back to number 30 maybe. So, you say I want to have this package number 30 and then 4.16.11 dash 1 is going to be installed aha we have a problem failed to prepare transactions downgrading package he says breaks dependency linux should be higher that's this this sign that i'm reading here linux should be higher than 4.18 so basically he's, he's telling me yeah you can do that but we need to be higher than 18 so my guess is he'll be happy when we take number nine yes he is so it's in the package build um, your recipe you know where it says okay it needs to be bigger or at least that one now what's very important is the next option the next question he's going to ask you this is this applies for anything really it says add Linux to ignore package. That's very important because you don't want to have, get the next kernel or the next update in. If it's Firefox, if it's a time, uh, um, how is it called again? Let's see, time shift is the name. So anything really that, that comes along and you don't want to update it, you need to add Linux to the ignore package. Now what happens? Always nice to know what happens on your system. ETC, the most important file I think probably is pacman.conf, the configuration for your package manager. Here you'll see that there is here a line ignore package. Pacman won't upgrade packages listed in ignore package and members of the ignore group. When I say yes, and I go back and I click on this file, he has added uh, he added a line to it okay he did not replace this one doesn't matter it's this is a hashtag anyway so it's it's just uh, unimportant it's a comment ignore packages linux it says now so whenever there's a new linux kernel coming along i will not update you must be aware of that and i do believe when you update your system there is normally an also a little message Warning, Linux ignoring package upgrade, you see? So I have this version and there's already six versions uh, more, but I say, no, no, I'm just gonna keep using this Linux kernel because I know that it worked. 
So that's how you downgrade, well, any package and in particular Linux.